How's it going everybody? Welcome to the first video from the new GT6 server. This is our um, series of GT6 now that the full release is out. So we'll be playing till the end. Um, these videos will be a companion to the streams that we do. Uh, right now it is me, Crazy, and Excel, or Prey on Prey, if you've been to our streams. Um, Prey on Prey and I will be working over in this general area together. And Crazy has her own place over there that we'll go look at in a little while. Um, me and Excel will be doing the factory machines. Uh, things like that crazy will be doing farming and whatever else crazy the crazy things crazy does you know so we took off from spawn and went about 2,000 or so blocks I forgot to mark it so I can't show where it's at crazy found a jungle and I found a GT Fort. We also have a um, pyramid here, a desert temple. Then a cell found a cave right here, which I got to talk to him because apparently he didn't get the uh, memo that you don't put doors on a cave. He went and made this nice, fancy entrance. I'll leave his doors there for now but I had to fix them because well first off they're not on the outside they were on the inside and they didn't open they were not fat man approved um, most of the progression type stuff setups things like that we'll be doing in the streams but for this first one we're gonna do our first bit of progression here in the video and I will attempt to remember about where we did um, the actual setup during the stream since streams are usually about two to four hours long I will try to remember exactly where it's at and put a uh, link or mention it here in the uh, video about where it is so if you guys want to go see and see us set the stuff up you can go and uh, do so without having to watch the whole thing but today we need to get started so that means first things first we need a fire starter and don't have any yeah, there we go. Eight regular cobblestone. I'll put that together. Yes. A furnace. I do believe we should have some clay around here. Wood and then gravel. Or mob drops. I don't know. He had said he grabbed some. Uh, can't open that one. Said he had grabbed some clay. Quite sure what he would have done with it. Oh, hey, there we go. Get like three of these out of here. Or no, we need uh, five. Throw that in there. That'll take about 10 sticks to get done. And we're going to make a mixing bowl today. So we need the clay. I need to go grab two flowers, make a hammer, and I'll need a chisel, which means I also will need a file. So, let's 
Let's come on out here real quick and see if I can find some red flowers. We got yellow ones, white ones that are technically not white. I hate the fact that white flowers are technically light gray. You have this flower forest over here, so I'm sure there's some red ones. I think that's a red tulip right there, but poppies. We'll grab them. We actually have a gold vein right here that we found. And we also have a um, redstone vein, but it is a baby vein. It spawns starting at like level five, so. We're going to get just the cinnabar we need out of it to make our first uh, thermostat, and that's going to be about it. All right, so there's my red. There's my hardened clay. Let's look over here. Let's get... Lead. We're going to use lead for file. Um, wait a minute. I need to get more of them. And you can see I picked up a whole bunch of cassiterite and tin and copper. There's more over there in the box. That is what we're going to be potentially putting together today. Let's actually make our bronze. If you guys want a quick, easy uh, tutorial for making bronze. Uh, I'll put a thing up here in the corner to the uh, three videos we made that basically go through the process that I'm going through now. It's uh, nice and short. I think it's like five minutes per video tutorial. Wise, you have this, which will just right here process all right so now I need a hammer found some red granite so we got plenty of red granite rocks we picked up some rocks on the surface got enough to make a pickaxe and then pickaxe to uh, mine the red granite and then use more of them to make a hammer so we could break up a bunch in the rocks. And I've been using the rocks uh, to make pickaxes. So there we go. There is our anvil. So we can now take lead on top, spread it out, and get the hammer. Three that on go. That's the three of those, and then I've got the sixteen scrap comes back out of that. I'm just gonna throw down here in the ore box. Next time we need some lead, we have it. Put these together, make our file, go ahead and add six so we don't have to craft it twice. File, ingot, we'll make our rod. Then it should be one of these two, I never can remember which. Go. 
chisel, which again I could have put the stick in and I didn't. There we go, there's our chisel. Chisel, hammer, red, mixing bowl. That in there. And let's see, I got 24 of these. That would be uh, the 810. Right? So we'll just throw that in there. There. More. Coal. Them. Furnace, fire starter, gotta be careful that thing doesn't sit there and run without anything in it because if it gets, because uh, you get nuggets out. Always got to take out a little bit of it, or you're going to end up with over a stack sitting there. Once that gets done, I will take one set of these down there. Start it down here, and we'll get all these nuggets made. And now we can start shoving these in here. That'll make our bronze mixture. Start smelting up once everything else gets done. That in there. That in there. More bronze compound. Nice little load of bronze here. Hey, give me that back. Thank you. Excuse me, I'd like the bronze back out of there. Thank you. Have that. This will get us some uh, bronze tools, our bronze burning box, all that kind of good stuff. Need. Where's the rest of the bronze? Give me the rest of the bronze. It did give me the rest of the bronze. Have to eat my uh, last fruit salad here in a second. More of those, and we'll be done mixing up our bronze. Start stuff cooked up. Should be it. There we go. That is all of our bronze mixture. Wood. Go ahead and some um, here in the planks. This in between these two. Let them get started on making our bronze nuggets and then we will have our bronze ingots which we can turn into plates just like we did the lead make a burning box make pickaxes anything we'd like so there is us getting to bronze 
for the first time. I'll take you guys over here in the video here. Show you guys Crazy's place since it's a uh, fortress. We didn't actually go out looking for a fortress. Happened to uh, find it right here next to this jungle, which uh, was kind of nice finding because 1710 jungles are a little hard to find. And there are two kinds of trees that are only found in the jungle. That being cinnamon and moho. Also, if I can, if they didn't clear them all out, which they didn't, see that when you get to the water on the edge, that Greg has his glotus all over in the water. So that's a place you can find them in the wild. There's one of the moho trees right there and i'm not sure if crazy's cut down all of the uh, cinnamon trees or not they look a lot like a rubber tree so uh you can kind of look for like that right there that's a cinnamon tree right there <laughs> there you go and i'm gonna do a video explaining all the different trees where to get them what you do with them all that kind of stuff Crazy. supposed to be making me an area i do believe that's going to be it right there uh to uh show them all off go down here and i put the water drop in do not be a shadow and believe that that's a water drop and uh kill yourself but this is our Greg Tech Fort. Crazy will be setting up her operations. We got two libraries, no ZPM. That is the first one. Second one is down here. If you'd like to see the loot we found, um, you can go back and watch the first stream and see us. Uh, going through here and checking out the chests and stuff. Got this workroom here, which is all steel stuff. Yes, we have a mixing bowl and a um, anvil already, but I'm doing our progression stuff over there. Separate from hers, we will use the material that is in here. But we're going to make, um, get the ability to make the stuff ourselves before we start using it. Alright, so here's our barracks that has all the beds and stuff. We moved a bed out over there, and that's where our spawn is set. We have a glotus pool back here. And we also have our own... Another portal room. We didn't get an end portal room, unfortunately. We didn't get a Twilight Forest portal room, but we do have our own nether portal. Jump in there whenever we are ready. So, with that, let you guys go for the day. I hope you enjoyed. Hope to see you stop in the stream sometime and say hi. Back when we get some further progress done here on the server, probably after our next stream, y'all have a good one.